Are you smarter than a fifth grader? What? I'm out, I'm out. Uh, I don't know, whatever. Hey guys, John Cena here from the all new Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader on Nickelodeon, the quiz show where kids help grown-ups make the grade. Think you could make the grade? How many valves does the human heart have? What? Uh, I'm guessing 220. No, wait, no, hold up, hold up, hold up, no. One? Heart? Isn't that one valve? Uh, two? I don't know, whatever. I'm guessing nine. Uh, six. Damn it! I look so dumb now. <laughs> I was gonna say four, and then I thought six. I did not learn that in fifth grade. These questions are rigged. <laughs> you know what, they need to go back to school. That's what they need to do. <laughs> The Rocky Mountain Range starts in Alaska and ends in what U.S. state? The Rocky Mountain Range starts in Alaska and ends in Colorado. Is that right? I know we fly over them from New York to L.A. and it's always like... <laughs> so somewhere between New York and L.A. Got it. Correct. I win. Got it right. No! I knew it! That was so close. Great. I have the answer's New Mexico, apparently, so it is between New York and LA, and as I said, I am correct. Always. Next question. What is the lowest prime number? <laughs> Four? Three. No, it's two. It's two. It's two is the lowest prime number. No, it's one. Wait, I forgot what a prime number is. Oh know? my gosh! I've How always known we were smarter than fifth graders. I just said three. It's two. Then that would be a no. I'm definitely not smarter than a fifth grader. <laughs> what amount does the Roman numeral L stand for? Oh. I don't know. Oh my god, I don't know this. I feel like that's gotta be like 20. You know, you gotta go big or go home. A hundred? I was just gonna say a hundred. Maybe a uh, hundred? A hundred? Yeah, I'm gonna just follow y'all. Okay, <laughs> so our guess is a hundred. Four. able to answer those questions, then maybe you're able to answer this one. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? You want a little taste? I thought you might. Here's a sneak peek just for you. Let's get into fourth grade. Earth science is the category, and the question is, what era of geologic time is commonly referred to as the age of dinosaurs? Mesozoic, Cenozoic, Paleozoic. Cooper, logging in. I gotta think about things a long time ago now, huh? Yeah. Yeah, Zoic. I'm gonna take a peek. Locked in peek. <laughs> Cooper, okay. let's talk. Um, Cenozoic, I think of John Cena. He's a mammal. And, um, um, uh, Cenozoic is the time of mammals, so that is our time right now. Paleozoic is the ancient life. Um, that is before the dinosaurs, so I locked in a Mesozoic. I like what you're saying. I'm gonna go with A. Locking it in. Locking in A. You needed the help of a fifth grader to answer a fourth grade question. <laughs> the correct answer is. Like you've never seen before. And these grown ups. I am an elementary school principal. Doctor. Astronaut. Will be forced to admit. I am not. I am not. Not smarter than a fifth grader. In this classroom, the bigger the fun, the bigger the jackpot. The biggest, biggest, biggest prize in Nickelodeon history $100,000. Easy money? Not without these super students. To oxidize means to lose electrons. I was thinking the same thing. Sure, sure. It's the most fun you've had since recess. Answer is Benjamin Franklin. Great job. Oh.